Alright, welcome back to Final Fantasy X, guys. We decided to not let you watch us walk all the way back to the temple uh, that we have to get stuff from. Hopefully we did miss this one. If not, I have no clue, guys. Hey, look who it is. Why, it's you again. You still on the road? Yes, but we're not going to Zanakind. It kind of sucks this uh, time of year. We want to go in the winter. I decided to go to Bartello's mm -hmm. homeland. We are going to let the other summoners deal with sin. I'm... I'm scared. Hey, don't worry about it. We'll put Sin in his place in no time. <gasps> you mean, the final summoning? No, we found another way where no one has to die. Well, whatever it is, good luck. Cross your fingers. Do your best. Bartello, time to go. Should be much less of a bitch. Well, it just takes going on a journey and kind of realizing stuff to get your character to arc. Mm-hmm. By the way, the best part of this entire thing was as we were walking back and all of a sudden the priests and all the guys were walking around and all of a sudden they come up and they're like, we're behind you all the way! And she nearly freaked out. <laughs> I, I didn't even <laughs> up to me and I was like, what the hell? We were like... Oh I'm man, like, they just lied to us. I was like, internet, what? Oh, I was like, oh my gosh, thank goodness. I was, gonna be, I was gonna be really pissed. Okay, guide me through this thing really quickly. Okay, we're just gonna speed this up until we get to the treasure. After ride a new, there's a new pedestal in the center. Return to the elevator platform and ride back down to the lower level. Yeah, I think we just went off. <clears throat> now what? Locate the glowing spot on the west wall next to the floor switch and examine the glowing glyph. It's glowing spot to reveal a glyph. Yeah, we did not do this. We did not. I think we went straight upstairs. Yeah, there's our destruction sphere. Take it and return to the upper level on the magic list. Yeah, just because I would like to do Persona 4 sometime as a run, but I really just want to do Golden. Well, we might have to take our pick here. I'm so used to having to like... Place the destruction sphere into the center pedestal. This destroys the section of the wall. I'm just going to be like, I'm so used to Aaron Fitzgerald as GA. It's going to sound really weird hearing someone else. Okay. Yay, we got it. Okay, guys, we are done. Ugh. Took us this long. And uh. apparently I want to push the ceiling. Somebody kill me. Gotta raise that roof. Gotta... <laughs> raise the roof. Raise the roof. Okay, guys. We're not done yet, though. Nope. We got one more plate temple to go to. This... After all, even Xanderkind has its own hidden treasure. I hate. Could you consider Cloister Trials Dungeons? Kinda. Then I hate that place. Definitely one of my top ten least favorite dungeons. <laughs> I'm gonna make that list one day and then explain it. Here's what we can do. You can make the list on my computer and we'll upload it to my channel. I'm gonna make that list and explain my reasonings for everyone. Just cause I know you don't play many games with, that dungeons. with dungeons. I have, so I could probably do it. I could probably make a good top, a decent top ten, and then you guys can be like, "You loser! You only play uh, JRPGs and other stuff," and I'll be like, "Yes, I do." Well, that's why we call it a fangirl play. <laughs> I'm like, "That's what I do." We guys. mainly play JRPGs on here. Like, that's what I do, guys. That's what I do. I literally have my set of playing just. <laughs> I am literally of not just JRPGs. I am literally not cool, cool enough to play things like Overwatch and freaking. I want to play Overwatch. I do sometime. too. I really do. <clears throat> oh, I gotta walk back. Why can't you drop us off at the temple? <laughs> oh my 
god, it's like Zan- it's like the Jose Temple walk all over again. Screw you, Darkland. We're running from everything. I will go so easy Ain't on nobody got time. Oh, if you had taken that right down Diagon Alley like I said, and went left at the Death Star, we wouldn't be lost. Oh my gosh. Can you please not haggle me on directions? <sighs> anyway, ain't nobody got time <laughs> for this. So we're gonna just run from everything. Besides, we've been let yeah. live. We'll cut we'll cut to the temple. Oh my gosh. We've been let live! Yeah, no, my brother said when he woke up last time they just got the airship. I should have asked, what do you mean by got the airship? Do you mean from under the water in the game? Or do you mean you're heading to the bell in the airship? See, you couldn't have literally put us at that. Ugh, whatever. <laughs> they just want to torture you. Completely and utter torture. Never mind. I wish we had some item that prevented you from... You know, Google it for me. Google if there there has there is one like item that Final Fantasy item that prevents uh random encounters. Live and let live. Final Fantasy ten item. Yep, it's the first one that comes up too. Cause I know there is an item for it. If not, you can never get Lulu's on your night thing. You are you are searching for purifying salt. You need thirty. You shall receive 99 for unlocking, uh, Fatnir. 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 You Fatnir. can steal it from warrior monks in Bevel, fallen monks in Xanarkand, abandon in the monster arena, horn in the monster arena. Ah, so I can literally get them from here. By the way, I learned the perfect strategy for that guy. I'll what? be right back. Literally, cast haste on everybody you can. Use Lulu, uh, use Lulu... Yuna, um, Titus, and Orin cast Protect on everybody that'll save you from the Haymaker attack and just pelt them with attacks. I'll be right back. And every time somebody starts going down, use Yuna to heal. It, <laughs> that's all I literally did this entire time I was, um, I was grinding. grinding. Yeah. Good times, though. I learned a lot, so. <laughs> I'll be right back. No, you won't. Cause yeah, you need. Um, oh, and Geo J, Geo J. Did we fought? Yeah, he drops no encounter weapons. I don't think we've done it. I'll any. be right back. If we did, I'm just curious. I don't think we got any, but... Well, if we did, now I know what to do when, uh... If I ever feel like... Yeah, I don't see any. Oh well. Now I know what to do if I ever feel like trying to... Do a run where I just do everything. Uh, imagine... Doing a nemesis. It's like, some people who do speed on this do nemesis percent. Oh, man. I just can't imagine putting all that work into this. Yeah, but speedrunning it. I know, I'm just saying I can't imagine all that work you put into this. Yeah. It's too much for me. But then, yep, here we are, guys. See, we got one final cloister trial puzzle. Oops. Anyway, I gotta go step on all the white tiles. Uh, oh, the I one mean, in the middle, right there. There oh, you go. I did not want to touch it. I wouldn't have either. You all know how much I hated this place before. How angry I got, so you didn't need to see that again. It's okay. You didn't need me to see. You're cool. You're fine. See, I literally you're think, fine. Uh, my brother's one complaint about like the PS3 controller is he likes it, but he says it's so light. He feels like he's going to snap it in half every time he gets angry. Oh, I know. <laughs> Okay. Okay. We gotta take me into Stretch and Sphere. Time where to go. 
Okay. Take it to the to, to the right of the monitor in the large chamber. I really think you think of the worst. The most inappropriate name for this next summon. Oh god, what is it? I said I need to think of one. Like the most name that just does not suit it. Okay, we got the final thing. Now we return to Baj Temple. Be right back. Are we gonna finish it tonight, you think? No. No. <laughs> okay. No way. Unless we stay up all night, do I? Because I'm not sure. I'm not sure I can stay up all night. <laughs> exactly. Back in we go. We'll just, we'll get this done today and then we'll just work all day tomorrow on Eternal Sonata. Because yeah, I was going to say, if you wanted to uh, get all the summons and stuff, no way. It doesn't really matter to me. Anima's the most important one. Yeah, pretty much. And we don't need, like, the ultimate weapon or anything. But we don't need to fight it. Yeah. Like, I unfortunately cannot tell you what to do against, you know, the fourth time we have to fight Seymour, because I've never beaten him through legit means. How'd you beat him through non-legit means? I used them first time with the, before this got redone on the PS2 version. I used their overdrive and one-shotted him. <laughs> and then the second version I used their overdrive, but unfortunately because they took that they took the the thing away, I can't one-shot him, so then I literally just used them the whole fight. So Okay. Well then we'll have to get we'll have to get you a Jimbo so we can get the Magnus sisters. We can just show how to get them. Okay, guys. So this should all light up now. And we should be able to get our summon. I still haven't thought of a good name. I've never gotten an anima, so I don't know what to do. But now I do. Cool. Yeah. You have to get all the uh, destruction sphere chests and everything. I don't think I even cared on my first run about the destruction spheres, but now I know I should have. That's because they're all optional things. But now I know what to do now, so I'll be able to play this game whenever I feel like it and not feel bad. Alright, guys, so now we're gonna enter the Chamber of the Faith. And nobody here will know that we went in, so it's okay. Exactly. This place is pretty much abandoned. Yeah. Hmm. to show her off in battle. We will. And look who it is. It's Seymour's mom. Mm-hmm. One of the most powerful Aeons in the game. Yeah. You are Maester Seymour's mother. So you know, yet still you seek my aid. My son, do you not hate him? He is kind of a douche. It is all right. He is the one who sowed the seeds of hatred. He is to blame. Indeed. But I couldn't I agree with you more, Mama. Letting him become what he was. Yeah, he became some gigantic-looking robot monster. He was always alone, half guardo, half man. I wanted to give him the strength. So technically, Annie was sort of like a final A on everything in a way. Faith. Because. But. See, because he, she I turned. Taste power. So yeah, once he used he the final. Because Aeon made on something, he. He was not satisfied yeah. with my Aeon. He wanted more. More power. 
it is really sad and everything. Like, his mother did all this for him in hoping that he would be accepted among the people, but... He ended up digging sin. himself into a more gigantic hole. Yeah, so... Yes. Well, she blames her son for pretty much a lot of this to happen. She blames herself, too, for sort of doing this. For causing it, as well. The dark Aeon, Anima, destroy sin and my son's obsession with it. Yes, and she just wants us now to stop her son. Though it is small recompense for what I did to him. Yay, we got it, guys. Okay, what are you gonna name her? I have no idea. I thought you said you had a really inappropriate I one. I said I have to think of an inappropriate thing. Something that just does not suit this beast. Sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <I have> <laughs> name her Sunshine. Sunshine. Seriously, I think you have enough. S U N. I think I ju just have enough. <laughs> name her but Sunshine. No. If I can't think of anything else in like the next 20 minutes, 20 seconds, uh, I was thinking, for some reason, I was like, I should totally just name it Tifo. <laughs> it would be great. <laughs> We're gonna go with it. Okay. I'm gonna name it, because you know, you all know you wish that's what Tifo looked like, guys. <laughs> Tifo's final form. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're going with it, guys. We're going balls out and naming it that. That's my inappropriate name. I was thinking of a person like I should totally do it. There you go. Name a depot. Plus, it kind of works. Seeing as actually Elise uses dark based magic and everything, so. Hmm. And anyone has a dark Yeah, name? but Tipo definitely ain't that way. Oh. Feel the pain! Feel the pain. Look at the hiccups again. No. Okay. <laughs> Look on the bright side. You get a name, Yo Chimpo. Cool. You can I name... hope we have enough money for you, Jimbo. Well, we'll also go th through and fight stuff, and we can get money that way, too. We we're not... To... I guess we're not gonna show all of the battles in that area. Oh, hell no. We have to be careful. We should be good now at this level to fight everything. Yeah. Plus, you can show Tifo off. Exactly. Hopefully, as long as we don't run into a ton berry, we'll be okay. Oh, jeez. Oh, look. There's a tonberry cloud. Figures you should probably run away. No? Alright. Good knowing you. Figures, <laughs> oh, ow. Things aren't supposed to bend that way. <laughs> okay, anyway. Let's get out of here. Anyways, we're gonna actually cut the episode off here for now. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more. I do videos like this every other day. I'll talk to you guys later, alright? Bye-bye.